Three, two, four, one is my placing of this class of Agus heifers. I start my class off with three, the moderately framed heifer of the class, as she is the most complete in terms of depth of body and structural correctness. Ideally, I would have liked to have seen my class winner clear through her chest floor. Nonetheless, it is three over two, my top pair. She is the most cushioned on both ends of the skeleton as she offers more flex to her knee and her hock, while being the deeper through her center body, having a more robust sweeping rib cage. I do appreciate that two is large framed and long sided. However, I find her second as she is coarser fronted when evaluating her from the profile in addition to being shallower flanked. In moving to my intermediate pair, it is two over four as she takes the advantage in terms of body capacity and muscling. Here is a heifer who is wider and more elevated in her chest floor and carries this added advantage in whip through to the flank. Furthermore, she is heavier muscled as she shows more three-dimensional muscling in her lower quarter and is flatter on her top line. I do grant that four is more feminine in her appearance as she has a longer, cleaner neck that fits to the top of a more correctly angulated shoulder. However, I find her third as she is easier flushing through her center portion. In moving to my bottom pair, even so, it is four's advantage in overall femininity that places her over one in my bottom pair. Here is a heifer who is longer and freer striding, as she has more correct angulation to her shoulder while being while being more nearly level from shoulder to hip. And while being more nearly level from shoulder to hip and being placed and tying in higher at her tail head. I do grant that one is freer of waist throughout. However, that is arranged for me today, as she is the lightest muscled, narrowest made heifer in the class, being the flattest ribbed, narrowest based and therefore, I find her at a distant fourth. Thank you.